What's going on everybody? Welcome back to the channel. My name is Chris and before we get into it I have to ask you to hit that subscribe button, hit that like button and share it with somebody you think might enjoy this. Now today, today is something different. Uh, today I have been commissioned to work on a can project. I've been asked to do four cans for her son, four cans for her daughter and two cans for herself. Uh, the ones downstairs in her living room are going to be like neutral tones, no color. So I think I'm going to do something decorative and ornate for those ones instead of something cartoony or character based. And the ones for her kids rooms, uh, one is more sports and skulls and video game kind of aesthetics. Uh, so I'm going to do something like that for the little boy. And then for the little girl's room, I'm going to do something a little lighter, lighter colors, pinks, purples, yellows. Uh, something with uh, her zodiac symbol, something with um, uh, unicorns and butterflies and, and stuff like that, long flowing hair and lips and teeth and, you know, things like that. Uh, let's separate these cans that I've worked so diligently to uh, have primed and ready to go for this project. So let's, uh, let's set these up, separate them, figure out what's going to go on each can and... Uh, Let's just have some fun with this one. I've been driving this train Years in this lane There's no stop in this flame Cause I came to the game And I changed it to play How I like rearranged it To my own domain Yeah I got what it takes Made lots of mistakes Taking shots Skipping breaks Feeling lost Feeling great Popping off Singing straight Never stop Never changed All the squad here to play And I've got something to say Yeah I work hard each and every day I get lost in the words I say I don't push pause No I push play I won't stop till I make a change I withdraw on the things I make I turn flaws into flawless traits I build tall, never cap in space I won't stop till I hear him say Again, I got tired eyes, need a cup of blend That's right, in the AM, that's my only friend No light, just the sun coming up on the horizon I lose track of time, yeah, I move fast and climb A new class divine, yeah, true passion shines And I'm through passing time, I choose stacking dimes You snooze half the time while I move passing by uh. I work hard each and every day I get lost in the words I say I don't push pause, no, I push play I won't stop till I make a change I withdraw on the things I make I turn flaws into flawless traits I build tall, never cap in space I won't stop till I hear him say
So when it came time to paint the tops of the cans, I didn't want to get any spray paint on what I've already done. So I wrapped the cans in paper and I put some tape around the top just to make sure I didn't, you know, get any overflow or any, any spray paint on the actual artwork. A few of the cans I sprayed with an antique ivory. Some of them got a red finish. Some of them got black. Two of them got gold. I love the way they turned out. After I sprayed them, I also gave them a clear coat when I did the clear coat on the final project, on the final cans. And uh, I think everything just turned out amazing. I couldn't be happier. What do you guys think? Let me know if you like the tops of these cans painted. It's new, I've never painted the tops before. I actually kind of think it's cool. What do you think? Let me know, comment below. So if you liked what you've seen here today, please reach out, hit me up, DM me, go to the website, hit the button that says commission me. I would love to work on a piece just for you. I would love to sit down and collaborate and come up with something interesting and amazing. So head on over to randomhero.ca and uh, click that button. See you there. What is going on, friends, followers, well-wishers? I love you all. What is going on, everybody? Well, here we are. We're at the end of the project. This took so much time. I thought this was gonna take, I don't know, a week. I thought I was going to blow through this in a week. I thought I was going to do one image on each can. Turned out to be a massive project. I put a lot of work into these cans. I couldn't be happier. I could not be happier with how it turned out. Let me break down for you what is going on. I had somebody reach out to me online and say that they loved the way that I did my cans. Right? They thought it was fun, interactive, playful, perfect thing for a bookshelf. Uh, they wanted something for their son's room and for their daughter's room, something they can put on the bookshelf, four cans in each room. So these are the cans for her son and daughter. And she also asked if I could do a set of cans for her living room. Uh, she told me she wanted blacks, golds, silvers, grays, so I knew, I knew she liked neutral tones and, and colors that stood out. So I immediately wanted to depict it, not like a character based thing, but more like a decorative ornate design, something delicate, something beautiful. The pattern I chose was just way too, um, it was way too intricate and it was too much for me to do with gold. I wasn't able to depict shadowing or texture or or folds for some reason. I, I tried, but I, I wasn't able to pull it off. Even if I was like adding a little bit of white or a little bit of black to my gold to tint it, it, it changed the gold so much that it wasn't a tinted color of gold anymore. And it just didn't look right. It didn't look right. I didn't want to continue with it. I scrapped it. I, I painted over it do think that I pulled it off this time. It's not 100%. But for $10 a can, and for what I've learned, just practicing this, I really believe that this was the best that I'm able to do at the moment. And uh, I'm gonna I'm gonna actually work a lot harder on this pattern, this design. And I'm gonna see if maybe I can paint this somewhere around a frame of a painting and see if I can incorporate this in the future because I did learn a lot from painting these. I really did. I really hope she loves them. I love them so much. So I, I painted those 
and she loved all the pictures that I sent her and asked me if I would do three more. Yes, believe it or not, three more for her bathroom. Okay, so she wanted something light colored. So I went with a classic ivory top. Uh, I think I went with uh, antique ivory, actually. And uh, these are the cans here. These are the cans here. I went for her bathroom. She wanted something with light colors, so I went with like a very light baby green. Uh, I wanted it to also be decorative and not stand out, so I didn't go character base. I went with uh, cactuses instead. So on this side, I have a cactus in a planter. Uh, a standalone cactus and then just decorative leaves in the middle um, and then on the back side I did a double-headed cactus with with flowers on it I really love these and I really hope she does too I think these are gonna look great sitting on a shelf in a bathroom out of the way nice and beautiful <clears throat> okay now, I painted the tops of these cans special. Normally, I just leave them silver. But I painted the tops of these cans uh, because the customer requested it. I think it looks dope. I think this looks so cool. I mean, look at these ones down here. I never expected this. This is a great turnout. Uh, so I did these ones for her son. Uh, what I'm also going to include for her son are these can collars, right? I, you probably don't care about them, you know, throw them in the garbage. Um, but I like to keep my can collars on my cans. It's just something extra, it's a little decoration. So I'm gonna throw them in for her son. Uh, I wouldn't recommend putting them on the other cans because they will chip the paint off the rim. But uh, I'm assuming here, I'm making a hard assumption that her son doesn't really give out a chip or two. Uh, and even if he does, he could touch it up with a Sharpie. So I'm going to include the can collars for her son and the can collars just come off the lids, right? Like if you uh, smash the top, there you go. You got yourself a can collar, right? So I'll include those in there for her son uh, along with a set of stickers and a print in the box. So while I was doing this project, I decided to do a couple extra cans just for myself for my own website right so in amongst these I did this one uh, this one and this one here so if anyone would like one of these three cans head online randomhero.ca click the link in the description head on over there you can pick one of these guys up uh, they're cheap these guys are cheap you can get one of these for ten bucks uh, you can add it on to any sticker pack, print, or painting if you want one of those too. I thank you. I thank you for your support. So these guys will be online with the other ones that were already online. And uh, I think I'm going to start doing these a lot more often. After doing this project and this set where I've done multiple images on a can, um, it makes me feel... Uh, much better about my work. It actually feels more complete and I would be much happier selling these the way I've done it than I would with just a solo image. So well, I think going forward from now on I'm going to start putting a lot more effort into my cans and looking at them like they are a standalone art piece of the, all of their own. And um, that might mean I might have to charge a little bit more than $10 a can, especially if I'm going to be putting in that much time. But I think it's worth it. I think there's value there. I think there's value there for sure. So that's what I'm going to do. Time to step up my game, right, folks? So you'll find me at Super Crawl. You'll find me at Art Crawl. You know, pushing all my wares. Paintings, prints, uh, wire sculptures and uh, cans, I'll be pushing cans and sticker packs, you know? So let me know if you like them. But 
Uh, that wraps up this project. What we're gonna do now, I'm gonna show you uh, a montage of all the cans, uh, close up so you get to see them all. Um, please comment below. Please tell me which can you liked the best. Um, rate, uh, subscribe, like it, share it, and uh, do all the things, you know? Help me build this channel and uh, we'll see you on the next video. Enjoy the final shots. Boom. Boom, 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 boom.